Tano Sports Central, we cover a college football bowl preview and prediction on the 2021 Liberty Bowl matchup between the Mississippi State Bulldogs and the Texas Tech Red Raiders. Both teams have had good seasons to this point. Should make for a good matchup here in the Liberty Bowl. We'll be going over a full game preview and prediction on this matchup here today, starting out with your team trends. Mississippi State lost to Ole Miss. 21-31 was the final score there in the Egg Bowl final game in the regular season. Mississippi State took the loss. But Ole Miss is a very good football team. Rebels are in a New Year's Six Bowl game and currently ranked in the top 10. So they have had an outstanding season. But Mississippi State ends up at 7-5. One game losing streak going into this matchup. As for Texas Tech, lost to Baylor, number eight team in the nation at the time, 24 to 27. Baylor is also a very, very good football team. So I mean, it's not, it's not a terrible loss losing by three to a very good football team there. But Texas Tech, nonetheless, is six and six. They've lost four of their last five and currently have a two-game losing streak heading into this matchup. It'll be on Tuesday, December 28th, Memphis, Tennessee. Your kickoff time is 6:45 p.m. Eastern time. So we got a Nighttime kickoff here for this matchup. Spreads going with Mississippi State here by nine. Uh, so Bulldogs are actually heavily favored in this matchup, which isn't terribly surprising because Mississippi State does have a better record than Texas Tech. Uh, plus, the Bulldogs have played a tougher schedule, a much tougher schedule uh, versus Texas Tech. I mean, the Red Raiders, they've played Oklahoma, Oklahoma State, and Baylor, uh, three very good football teams. But if you look at Mississippi State here, I mean, they play Kentucky, Auburn, Ole Miss, Texas A&M, Alabama, uh, NC State, LSU, the list goes on, and Arkansas as well. So, I mean, they've uh, played a very tough schedule here. Uh, but nonetheless, both teams have still had good seasons. I mean, Texas Tech at 6-6 six and six isn't, isn't the best record, but they've had a couple of close losses that, I mean, if you flip those around, Texas Tech is a 8-win team right now. But yeah, over-under is 59.5, and, and your FBI is also going Mississippi State here, 68.3%. So, uh, Bulldogs are favored in this matchup pretty significantly. Series history, Mississippi State leads at 4-2. Uh, they've won the last two games, and the last game was in 1970. So it's been several decades since we last saw these two teams play each other. Here's your stat comparison. Mississippi State with 30 points per game, 25 points allowed. 385 passers game, 63 rush yards. And then for yards allowed, you got 230 passing, 101 for rushing. So very heavy passing offense here in the Bulldogs. Uh, Will Rogers has had a huge part in that. He's second in passing yards. Um, in the FBS, which is incredible. Uh, 4,400 passing yards on the season, 35 touchdowns, eight picks. It's been a solid season for him. His accuracy has been good as well. So yeah, Rodgers, definitely a surprise quarterback. He's actually played pretty well this football season, uh, but he have a lot of passing yards. Definitely can't complain about that. Uh, rushing game-wise, hasn't been anywhere near as strong. But for Texas Tech, 30 points per game, 32 points allowed. You got 257 passers a game, 150 rush yards, and then for yards allowed, 266 passing and then 144 for rushing. So for Texas Tech here, I mean, this is an offense that's, I mean, they're okay, but their defense lying 32 points a game. That is not a, that's not a good stat there, certainly. So definitely something to watch out for there. But passing defense has also not been a strength. 266 average pass yards allowed per game this season. Some recent matches, well, Mississippi State lost to Ole Miss 21-31, beat Tennessee State 55-10, had a quality win over Auburn 43-34, uh, Lost Arkansas by three and then beat Kentucky 31-17, to number 12 team in the nation at the time. So Mississippi State, they've won a couple of, of big-time games uh, against some quality opponents. I mean, Auburn was ranked at the time. Uh, Kentucky was ranked. So, yeah, both those wins certainly in the past five uh, games or so have been have been good. Uh, but for Texas Tech, they haven't won any any big-time quality game. I mean, they beat Iowa, beat Iowa State. That was a big win there, 41-38. to But they lost to Baylor. 27 to 24, lost to Oklahoma State, got shut out in that game, 23 to nothing, lost to Oklahoma, 52 to 21, lost to K State by one as well. So, I mean, none the stretch though for Texas Tech. I mean, if you look at this football team and their resume, beat Houston. I mean, that actually looks like a very good win now, 38 to 21, beat them in the first game of the season, uh, beat West Virginia, beat Kansas, uh, big time as well. So, I mean, they've got a couple of decent wins down the stretch, but they don't have a one they don't have one standout major upset i mean iowa state's a good football team that's probably i would say their best win uh houston and iowa state certainly are your two there but for mississippi state they've got several uh more quality wins if you're if you're looking at the schedule and the strength of the schedule here but some key points mississippi state seven and five will rogers has thrown over four thousand yards on the season so he's definitely a key impact player in this matchup they've won four of their last six Good momentum going into this matchup, and they got quality wins over NC State, uh, Texas A&M, Kentucky, and then Auburn. So once again, uh, not a bad season at all from here for Mississippi State. They've actually been 
it was kind of crazy. They were ranked. They were the first team to be ranked as a four-loss football team. They were uh, they were still ranked, I think, after a loss to, I, think, I don't know if it's Arkansas, but yeah, Mississippi State, this is a football team that the committee really likes, and I can see why. Their strength of schedule is tough. They've got a tough schedule, and they've played uh, reasonably well considering that. But for Texas Tech, Donovan Smith has started at quarterback for this football team since November. I mean, he's he's played okay. The quarterback situation has kind of been a mess for Texas Tech this season. Tyler Shuck got injured. Uh, and then you got Columbia as well, who's been in there. And then you got Donovan Smith in the past month. He's played okay. I think, I mean, he's got he's got potential to lead this team to a to a bowl win. But we'll have to see uh, how he performs in this game. That's definitely something to keep in mind. But they've lost four of their last five. So momentum isn't really there. They've kind of struggled down the stretch. Um, and they've got quality wins over Houston and Iowa State. But that's how let's get to the prediction here for Mississippi State and Texas Tech. I'm going to go Bulldogs here 38-24. to 24. So I'm going to take Mississippi State by a couple of touchdowns here. I just feel like all signs here in this matchup statistically, I mean, how these teams have played and injuries, etc. I mean, all signs point to Mississippi State winning this game. And I think they do cover the nine-point spread as of right now. I think Texas Tech puts up a fight. Uh, they're going to keep it close for a long time, score some points as well. But I just feel like that Texas Tech defense is just very, it's not. It's kind of concerning, and especially going up against a Mississippi State offense that's, I mean, they got Will Rogers, who's thrown for over 4,400 yards on the season and 35 touchdowns. And I feel like he's going to have a he's going to have a big day for the Bulldogs. And uh, Mississippi State gets the win, 38 to 24 in this matchup. I'm going to say 65% towards Mississippi State. So this is one of the uh, bowl, bowl games that I'm more confident in picking a football team. I just feel like I feel like Bulldogs here. I mean, they played a tougher schedule. They got a better record. Texas Tech has lost four of their last five. Mississippi State has won four of their last six. And they've got a much tougher schedule, more quality wins down the stretch. Texas Tech uh, hasn't gotten uh, those wins, and injuries have also affected the Red Raiders especially. Um, so that being said, I think Mississippi State gets the win here. I'm going to take the over on the 59.5 as well as of right now, and I also take uh, Mississippi State to cover the nine-point spread in this game with 14 points uh, being won here. But that being said, appreciate you guys all watching. Let me know your thoughts and comments below in this game, and I appreciate you guys all watching as always. Stay tuned for more from All Sports Central. I'll see you later.